Hi, welcome to this uh, system. <coughs> it seems we have already two updates up here. <coughs> so uh, this video is going to be about um, Sapphiro. It's an icon theme and we've created, um, we've shown how to uh, improve the index theme by uh, using inheritance line. But you can go even further if you'd like. And in this particular video, we're going to change the package build. So there is a kind of recipe on your system that says, um, sorry, there's some kind of um, recipe which is called a package build that you can run with make package. And the end result is then, of course, a tar.xz package that you can install by double clicking or pacman minus u. So in the meantime, I have already also updated my video and you've seen the commands what to do. Now, if there is anything uh, happening in the regards of Arco Linux that's going to be installed in the scale, then you just type scale and that's it. And then everything is up to date. That's the three commands you need. Um, so, <coughs> Sapphiro. Sapphiro icon theme. Let's kill all the rest, close all their tabs. If you go to arcolinux.com and you go to one of the last videos or, or articles, it's about Sapphiro here. Install the Sapphiro icon theme. I have added a few lines to this article and it said it's about the package build. So we can include that video in here. So we could change the package build that comes from online and add some lines in it to say, hey, go find me this thing, change it with that thing inside index team and then make the package. And then you have a package you could put away on Dropbox or something online. So with the next clean installation, you just double click, you have it. So the last three lines have been added and you um, that's the procedure how to do it. So let's make a video about that. So I'm gonna go from, from, from A till Z, right? Uh, so you learn how to do it yourself on another icon theme or any package at all. First off, I went to Ye. So Ye is one of our AUR helpers and I typed in man Ye because I wanted to actually get the package built, not the rest. So it says here G. G or a longer thing here, get package built. So both of them will work. That's what I wanted to do. So first off, I wanted to know again what was this name again. It's not called Sapphiro, it's called Sapphiro dash icon dash theme. So control C. So yay minus G, right? And then the long name, correct name. Like so. So what do we get? Let's get rid of this. Super shift return. We get a folder and inside it is a package built. So anything called package build that comes from the AOR, you can just open a terminal there and say, make me a package. And that's what it will do. It will take a look at this thing, which is in my eyes, and a recipe, and it will make from this recipe a package. And this package can just be double clicked and it will be installed to install, commit, it's there, it's installed. Or you say sudo pacman minus u, and then the word Sapphiro, and it's installed as well, okay? Now, before I install anything, I wanted to have a package build that was better. So the package build that is uh, in here is good, but it doesn't change the index theme. So if you compare what we get and what I have here, these three lines are added. Now, how do we get to these three lines? Linux bash re find replace, right? Something like that. And then you go Google and you say, okay, what is this bash replace? This is already something I've, I seem to have clicked upon. So let's have a look. Maybe it's, it was that one that I found the code. 
So you need to figure out what code is it do you want. And this is indeed something that could help me. So this is the code that I could copy paste. So that's how you start making your own bash. So in here, I'm going to put this line. Now, this is just the hashtag, so that goes out. And let's make some variables. Maybe you've seen already in package builds that we have this dollar sign in front of it. Package name is here, and it's a kind of drawer. And what goes into the drawer is this thing here. And if you call this one again with a dollar sign, then this long variable is replaced with Sapphira. Sapphiro icon theme. So what's inside? It's like a package version here. It's also here, package version. So it's replaced. So it's actually called Sapphiro icons dash 0.7.1. Not package version. So what we need to do, let's move this guy over here. What we need to do is to replace this letter thing of course is is something we don't want uh, let's let me check what i i've called it again i've called it search and replace okay so what i said is we're gonna search for something and we're going to replace it with something i could have called it variable one or variable two or anything really as long as it's not a very particular word that's uh, important for arch linux right just has to be a non-existing word search replace okay what am i searching for i am searching for uh sorry i am searching for something i don't know yet because i deleted it <laughs> so what am i searching for if you're really going for a till z right then you make the package let him do his job and what I'm, I'm looking for, I'm looking for this file here, index team, and inside the contents of the file, this is the line I want to replace. So, control C, replace that line with this line, right? But instead of GNOME, I would like it to follow first the servant icon so if if there is no icon available in Sapphire, then it will look into the folder servant else it will look into the folder numix circle i'm going to keep it with circle stuff so servant sorry servant numix circle right and then um the breeze thing i think it can be come here and not at the very end so GNOME high color is okay. Numix is replaced with Numix circle. Breeze is up at the front. So actually I'm saying this. I'm saying, okay, if you find this line inherits, then you replace it with this line, which is more appropriate in my view, of course, personal opinion. Now, what I'm gonna replace is not letter with new letter. I'm going to replace search and it's hola control z search is going to be a variable so i need to put a dollar sign in front of it and as well here replace so now this command set will say okay if i come across this thing which is actually this thing i'll replace it with this thing that's what happening happens with this i and s and g thing right but the file name is not correct file name is actually already almost at the top this line if we translate the line then it says all the space is gone oh one space is enough go to the package directory user share icons package theme name and have something I'm missing so let's move this one here so you see it so this has the name package let's go up let's go up Eric when you make a package 
this is the package that's created the package build was correct everything is uh, in, well created right it starts with a source a source folder <laughs> and then it's going to get this information inside a package folder so this is the working folder this is what actually is used actually is installed later on Arch Linux so if we click on this we have this package name so this package dir thing is this thing and then you go inside user share there's a license thing not important for us icons Sapphire icon this thing is this thing correct all right double click so I need to have a slash back there and then tell them hey go and have a look inside index team so what happens is I make the package the last thing you'll do is go check to this file at that particular pathway which is this pathway and say okay if I find it I will replace it replace it so now there are two things you can do you can either say I'm gonna delete this and this and this so we only have the package built or you can also try to have an make package with a force minus f but to have a clean look educational way you know you better delete everything so you're sure and then make package i will see if this extra three lines i haven't checked with the website if they're exactly the same but it should be right so you go into package sapphire user share like in sapphire and we have to open this one and this one should be changed and it's not changed let's open it again it's not changed so we have to check out what is wrong something is wrong since it's not changed at all okay so we have to look for the difference here is inherit gnome high color numix breeze look for it there must be a typo or something like that but this line control C is exactly that line or not yes save and we're going to replace it search replace package dir user share icons package name index theme correct so why is it not doing that must have missed something pausing okay checking with the website we see that there is a difference here between these little things that don't need to be there at all and let's try it again this time let's uh, let's not to clean it up and let's do a force so you see it as well you can make a package like that as well if folders already exist you can overwrite them that way and you see it, that was indeed the the trouble because we have now surf and humic circle up here so the final result is online the website was correct so this code that i am moving over here does not include this little i don't know what they call it in english little sign up here in front and the back so that was uh, the error the copy paste from here that's what is uh, in our case wrong well might be good here uh, will be good here but it's not in our case we need to get rid of it and that's it basically um we have now let's have a look we have now a icon theme that is here so we can install it and if we install it let's do it why not let's install it so double click you can double click right so i'm going to do this the terminal way so you see how it works it asks me to install i say install and so this can go this can go and these guys you can keep those guys on your uh, dropbox for next time on a clean installation you don't have to do anything anymore just install um that's that but let's have a look at the user 
the shared icons, the, the Firo icon theme. So if you run this thing, um, then you have here this index theme, Surfen, Numix, Circle, Breeze, Gnome, Hycola. So that's good, right? You have now the changed, adapted, improved version of Sapphire in your system. And that's what you wanted to have. If you change your applications, where am I going? Appearance, icons, all the way down. And we have a lot of icons all the way down. Sapphire, close. Then everything is going to look good. And the missing icon, since Sapphire does not have a con key, does not have Arch Linux Hello, these icons are coming from Surfen, right? So nothing is broken. And that's the point. Why are we making all these tutorials? To make sure you have an index team where all the icons are present. And you have to rely on a few of them. So that you have, well, everywhere an icon to start, right? And then you can start looking at what do I prefer in icons and change them in the inheritance line set one before the other so there you go we have Sapphire installed it's a, a pretty little thing and it's improved thanks to this index team if you learned something about uh, package building all right enjoy <laughs>